Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to feature a Matchbox car. This is the 2019 Ford Mustang Coupe. It is technically a Mustang GT. This is a Mustang series. There are six cars but we are going to focus the 2019 Mustang. There's the model finished in this kind of green paint very close to the 2018 Mustang bullet Highland green paint this is a new casting for 2020 I know 2020 has been quite a year for all of us with all the situation going on but let's go back to the model very nice casting overall the body lines are very visible, it's very close to accurate, the scaling is precise, the proportions are right. Let's start with the front, look at that sleek angry headlight tampos with the daytime running lights, the honeycomb grille together with the Mustang logo at the front, dual heat extractors in the hood, very aggressive looking, I like the fastback design there's the gold five spoke wheels it's plastic by the way the paint is fantastic there's a molded antenna on top of the roof there's also side mirrors that's very nice to have now let's move on to the back taillight tempos are there with the gt badge in the middle so oh, it's kind of sloppy it's not very accurate but it is an improvement over to the 2018 convertible that was a disaster there's the quad exhaust the kick up spoiler the base is plastic but i like the satin matte finish it's very nice to the touch very smooth and there's uh, some quite of details underneath the execution of the headlight tambos are very spot on together with the honeycomb grille the chin splitter is molded with a body. The gold wheels are decent. I like it better in black. The interior is pretty basic. It's all plastic. But it's nice to have an overall fantastic looking model. Again, the taillights are kind of sloppy. I wish they did better. But I like the spoiler and the Mustang license plate. I'm gonna compare it to the Hot Wheels version. This is a 2018 Mustang GT. As you can see in the Hot Wheels, they did a better job in the taillight department. The C-shaped tri-bar taillights are more accurate. The molding is very clear. So Hot Wheels win over in that department. But overall, the Matchbox is still better. Originally, the Hot Wheels version doesn't come with headlight or taillight tempos, by, but I added those up. But as you can see here, the Matchbox versions are far more sleeker. It's much more closer to the actual car. The chin splitter is part of the plastic base. It is rather thick though, but it also has the honeycomb grill. There are some subtle differences, but overall very similar. Moving on to the booty. If you look closely, the Hot Wheels is a little squinted down, like the overall thickness of the trunk to the diffuser. It's much more squished down, if that makes any sense to you. both versions have the quad exhaust steps i'm going to show you on top the overall scaling they are pretty similar the matchbox is a little bit longer which i like the rear end on the matchbox version is a little flatter the actual car is more curvier so hot wheels nailed on that one and there you have it the 2019 Ford Mustang GT in green from Matchbox. If you're stopping by for the first time and you haven't already, please do subscribe to this channel. This is a very solid piece. 
my favorite from this year so far and I'll see you on the next one.